of Sidonia is proud to be a pillar of support for the United Colonies. Seek your local Marine recruiter if you wish to sign up for military service. Sidonia is nice. <coughs> for a mining colony, I guess. Since you helped us out with the equipment and all... <coughs> I was wondering if I could talk to you. <coughs> it's... it's probably... <coughs> not, but... I can't afford to go get it looked at. <coughs> I know. I wish it were that easy. Actually, maybe this is wrong. You're a total stranger. Forget I said anything. Ready? That bad? I... Well, it's clear you want to help. Maybe I can trust you. See... I'd like to go to Reliant Medical for treatment, but my father, Nathan, is an executive with Reliant. I came to Sidonia to escape him. Nathan is not a good man. Not to me. And I did something terrible to him, so now he is searching far and wide for me. He has connections with doctors throughout the settled systems, I don't know which ones I can trust, and it won't end well for me if they snitch to him. After my mother died in an accident, he changed. He became obsessed with my protection, but he never listened to what that was doing to me. It got worse and worse. First, it was no traveling in ships without one of his pilots. Then, no parties, no drinking, no leaving the house. I obeyed. But he didn't trust me, so he started monitoring everything I did. It became so bad, he once locked me in my room for two days after an argument. Can you believe that? A prisoner in my own home. Every day there was yelling, lack of freedom, threats. I had to escape my prison. But even now, I am trapped. It's a risk I have to take. Yes, my condition is getting worse, but there's a chance it will clear up on its own. If my father finds me, well, I know my father and I fear for my safety. That is a definite. Trevor tells me you're skilled in dealing with people. Maybe you could try to reason with my father, or maybe scare him into backing off. But you should know, he has powerful and dangerous friends, so you must be careful. If it works, I'll be free. If not, well, at, at least he still won't know where to find me. What do you think? It just so happens there's a conference he goes to on Neon around this time of year. He always stays at Hotel Volai. He won't see visitors he doesn't know, but maybe he'll talk if you tell him you're there on my behalf. It's risky, but... Maybe he'll listen if he knows you mean him no harm? I've got it. Bring him a bottle of his favorite whiskey, Red Harvest Reserve. Say it's... <coughs> uh, say it's a peace offering from me. That whiskey is exceedingly rare. 
I'm sure it will pique his interest enough to hear what you have to say. As much as possible, yes. I intend to patch things up with him and work with him on our mutual issues. I believe with therapy we could repair our relationship as damaged as it is. Or if you discover it is irreparable, at least you could put the fear of God in him and that should deter him from taking further action. There may be, but getting him to listen to you is the key here. And what I've told you is the surest way I can think of. There was a time he had a falling out with his brother, and that whiskey did the trick to bring them back together. With that gift, he will know I am sincere. Good luck. You can check with Jack at the Broken Spear for the whiskey. He may have some or... <coughs> know where to get it. And thank you so much for- Caution. Subterranean particle detonation imminent. Be advised to secure loose articles and find stable ground or remain seated in the event of unforeseen tremors. Detonation occurs in five, four, three, two, one. like the type that could afford it. The last person that came through here asking about it was none other than Governor Hurst. Didn't even want to drink it. Said he was buying it to put it on display in his office or something. Seems like a waste, but eh, whatever. He paid up. Well, now you got my attention. This ought to be good. I do believe you, but you realize what kind of a bind this puts me in, right? You said that already. Easy. We're just talking, right? Tell you what, I'll do this as a favor for Rivka. She's been through a lot. I'll only charge you what I paid for the whiskey years ago. Pay me that. It's yours. I sure hope you're not pulling my leg about this whole thing. Or else I just let all that money slip away. You better do justice for Rivka. Can you hold on to that? To see if the value goes up, or, or use it to celebrate the occasion? Excuse me. Hey. Nothing bad Admire what Bayou has built for himself here. It's nice to see you today. Welcome to the Hotel Voli. Are you here to rent a room? 
I think you'll be pleasantly. <laughs> My hotel is com Indeed it does, but that's a story. So, can I book you a room for the night? Oh, how nice! His daughter must be feeling very generous to be sending him something like that. Mr. Ovadia is in his room on the third floor. I'll buzz him and let him know you're on your way. Harvest Reserve, huh? I assume this is from my daughter. Well, she knows how to get my attention. So what then? You're working with her? She thinks this will be enough to smooth things over between us? it was. Ah, I should have not been so blind. You have no idea what you're doing. You need to tell me where she is this instant. My own daughter assaults me in my own home, steals my personal spacecraft, then runs off to who knows where. Now you think a friendly little chat is going to smooth it all over and make things better? How foolish do you think I am? Hmm. My daughter knows me well. Maybe she is serious about this. Ah, uh, thanks. I'm I'm still collecting my thoughts. Maybe so. I suppose I've overreacted. She was young, and while foolish, she is still my daughter. And Rivka is all I have left of my wife. I would do her a disservice to incriminate her daughter like that. She told you about that. I'm not proud of it. I've wrestled with it ever since my wife died. I have been a terrible father. It will be up to Rivka how she wants me to make amends, and I will do whatever it takes. If she wants money, she'll get it. If she wants me to go to therapy, I will. Whatever it takes. I promise. Yes, of course. Understood. I will drop the charges against her immediately. I will call off the bounty hunters. Anything for you to leave me be. Please, just go. All right. I believe you have made your point. Your home away from home, here are... 
It's a wonderful day, my friend. Certainly, my friend. It was good of you to stop by, my friend. I believe everyone deserves a second chance, just not him. Learning to accept the truth of higher power is key to understanding people. Crimes at an all-time low around Edonia.
we need to talk. I just <coughs> heard that the charges against me have been dropped. Whatever you said to my father worked. It sounds as if I may finally be safe. Thankfully, it sounds as if that may not be necessary, but it is good to know such a guarantee exists. It is good that this chapter of my life is now closed and I can... <coughs> Finally, get the help I need. Thank you. They call this the red planet because it's not the moon. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be here all week. I used to think having a psychologist on staff was ridiculous, but after all this, maybe it's a good idea after all. <laughs> 